Hi, this is Miranda from My Scrappy Life and welcome back to my channel. This is another process video for Multi Monday Photo where we use two or more photos. And this is what we're going to use for our challenge. It is our mood board. And as you can see that there is what I call real life moments and there's black and white. You can take this in any different shape, way, or form and what I decided to do is is that I wanted to show you guys how you can be able to use these real-life layers of sheets that are coming in these collections like this one this one has a lot of real-life photos in it whether it's flowers it's the Eiffel Tower there's things like that are just real-life photographs that they decided to put on one of your paper pads or paper sheets or whatever you want to look at for your pattern paper and I wanted to show you guys on how you can be able to use that type of collection and those papers to make it real life. Now the photos that I have in the mood board that I have is very real life. It's just everyday moments that you have like people on the beach, you know, you're holding your hat, however you want to take it. Yes, it's black and white, but that's not what I'm really looking at. At the end of the day, my photos are black and white, so I did incorporate some of that. But what I did was is that these two pictures are of my daughter and her soccer post or pictures that I took. Now, one of them is of her sitting in our entryway getting her socks socks and shoes on and her or socks and cleats I should say just sitting down on the ground I didn't pick anything up I sat there and I made sure that it looked real life and I post it because I absolutely love the story behind it she is very competitive she made sure that her cleat stayed clean the whole time things like that is very much her style and I wanted it to show and the other one is of her and her first game and or no first practice actually and it's just her standing at the edge of the soccer field getting herself ready and that's what the photos are all about so it's that real life moment and these real life pattern papers that they are using for the collections is how I brought this mood board together and then of course the black you know the black and white obviously easy peasy right so what I decided to do is, is that I pulled a sketch as well to make this work and so that you can really see how you can use these real life pattern paper styles with these types of photographs. And so the cut file that I am, or not the cut file, but the sketch that I'm using actually had um, two on top for blocks and then one, two, three on the bottom. But I decided to do it just a little bit different and I did one big block in the center and then the three on the bottom. And then I did all my embellishments around the circles. And I took the exact same set of pattern papers. And this is um, All Heart, All Hearts Day, All Heart, All Heart from Crepe Paper. It's the new line that they came out with that's all about girls and, the, you know, it, it uplifts the girls. And as you can see, I am at a different location for my couple of layouts that I'm going to be doing here through this next week and you will see that I am obviously at a different one I'm at a crop and I just loved the vibes that I got from all of the friends that I got to meet again and I roomed with um two wonderful ladies because one night we had three of us in our room and then the other night we had another, you know, it was just the two of us. But we absolutely loved our time. We love ourselves together and it's just an, an amazing uplifting time for all of us because we do have, you know, we do have stuff going on. I, you know, Anybody and everybody can say things, but we all have things that are going on. And this collection is all about girl, like what I call girl power. Girls rule. It's such an uplifting um, collection. And I bought a lot of it. I love it. And it's something that works well for me and my style. And if this doesn't work for your style, I completely get it. But remember, you can take that mood board and you're going to see tons and tons of different um, styles because it really challenged the team this time for Multi-Photo Monday. And, you know, to be really truly honest, I'm almost betting we're going to see a lot of black and white type stuff. And when I originally found this 
mood board, I thought of this collection ASAP because I had it coming when I found this mood board for us to do this month for, you know, the challenge that we wanted to add to make just a little bit more to our, you know, our layout. So I am now just doing a bunch of embellishments and I'm just getting these blocks down. I absolutely positively love how this turned out. And I'm just, you know, adding all of my little bits and bobs and layering that I always do. You guys all know that I do. And at the retreat, you will see through some of my layouts too. I will state that I had to use my headset a lot because I was listening to, um, I was listening to Bravo Trash. I watch, um, when I go to retreats and stuff, I do laugh and giggle and all that stuff, but I do watch a lot of my Bravo trash. I get caught up on it while I'm there just because it's something that I just love to watch and listen to. And unfortunately, this time we had to put our headsets on because it, you know, last time we were able to at least let it play quietly without the headset so that we could chill and laugh and have fun. Well, this time we had to put our headsets in. So all of us were listening to a bunch of stuff in our heads because that was... We couldn't just play it outright because it was a little harder to um, talk and stuff because we're all having headset, which is fine, but we still had tons of laugh laughter. Dolly got to see this layout um, come alive, and it's just, I just love it. I just, I just love going to crops. If you ever have a chance, I will tell you this, if you ever, ever have a chance to go to crops and start to make those scrappy friendships, they just, they are just amazing. I have my best friends. I have my best friends. One lives in Savannah. The other one lives right here on this post. But I also have my scrappy best friends. And I absolutely love those. We can come together, talk about life. We're getting to know our families just that little bit more. We, you know, we hang out together. You know, this particular type of crop that we're at, we do have to room with people. And it just makes it just that much more. You know, we, Thursday night, we were sitting in the dark, the three of us. We were sitting in the dark trying to get some sleep. And we started talking about health insurance. Yeah, you heard me. We are, you know, we're all, I'm the youngest out of the little core group that that we all hang out with. I'm the youngest at 37. And then it ranges all the way up into the 60s. And let me tell you, we were talking about health insurance. Yep, I am going to lay it out there. That is, that is what us 37 year old plus talk about is health insurance. <laughs> but it's just, the environment is just amazing. And, you know, this is all about when we get together and we do these things and when I do my layouts, it's all about the mood that it comes with. And this mood board, bringing it back, is just amazing. And I absolutely, truly love how this mood board just brought my everyday life for my daughter. Her sitting right with the door open, all of her stuff is still there. It's not cleaned up because we were getting ready to go to soccer practice and then her standing on the edge of field for the first day. And I put down, you know, all these little bits and bobs and embellishments about girls rule and just things like that. Um, yay for today, love. Just, I just love it all. So I'm finishing it up. Sorry. I'm finishing it up with the embellishments. And as I do that, make sure that you go check out all of the other ladies. They have an amazing take on this as well. And I hope that you truly enjoy what this looks like. You know the still shots are coming up at the end. Also, make sure that you like and subscribe to our channels just so that you can be able to see more of this. And then just what we do in general on our own channel, just for everything else like that. So if you like it, go ahead and like and subscribe. Also, make sure that you go check out this collection. I will link everything down below along with my link to this Pinterest post as well as the ladies. So now I'm finishing up here. I do end with some black splatters. I can't, I think I do it on camera. I may either do it on camera or off camera, but either way, I do end up with some black splatters as well. That Again, the still shots are coming up along with everything is going to be linked down below. And I absolutely positively love this collection and I would love to get more of it but I'm not going to I just love it 
So with that, I'm going to let you finish it out, and then I will talk to you soon. Bye!